We are concerned with the ever-increasing reports of quack and fake medics who not only endanger the lives of our people, but they sully the reputation of government. I call upon you to be alert. Individuals who show fake medical certificates, open clinics and pharmacies without proper qualifications, sell suspect drugs, and those who fail to observe the code of ethics of medical practitioners. And that's why when people go on strike, it's very, very you know, distressing because it's about life and death. Our teachers can go on strike even for three months. You know, nobody will lose life. Unfortunately, we shall suffer in terms of education standards. But in our case, in our profession, unfortunately, somebody will lose his soul. So we really have to make sure that we up our standards. We have to make sure that we know the youth we took and the issue of money is not worth us losing one person in terms of losing their lives. So us as a ministry, we shall do what we can to make sure that this strike comes to an end as quickly as possible. Although, as we said, the issue is with the county governors, but we cannot run away from responsibility as leaders. Even us, you, in the profession, you can't run away from that moral responsibility to make sure that our medics go back to work.